Math lesson number 10. Solving word problems involving factoring special products. Solve the word problems and show the complete solution. Number 1. The area of square lap is 16x squared minus 24x plus 9 cm squared. Express the length of a side of the lot in terms of x. Now, for our solution, we have area of square is equal to side squared, which is equal to 16x squared minus 24x plus 9. Now, this one is factored into 4x squared minus 2 times 4x. That's the first term. And then, in order to get 24x, we have 2 times 4x times 3. We need to multiply by 3. And this 3 will be used in our last term. So, 3 squared is 9. Simplifying, we have 4x minus 3 squared. So, that is side squared. Therefore, side is equal to 4x minus 3 centimeters. Next, number 2. The volume of the rectangle box is HB or H times B where H is the height and B is the area of the base. If the volume of the box is X cubed minus 216 cm cubed, what is the height of the box in terms of X? So first, volume of rectangular box is equal to H times B which is equal to X cubed minus 216. Now, factoring x cubed minus 216, we have x cubed minus 6 cubed. 216 is 6 cubed. So, following general form number 2, x minus 6, that's a minus b, then x squared plus x times 6, that's a squared plus ab, plus b squared is 6 squared, because b is equal to 6. Now, Simplifying, we have x minus 6 times x squared plus 6x plus 36, in which this one is h and this is b. So, h equals x minus 6, b is equal to x squared plus 6x plus 36. So, the height is x minus 6 centimeters. Next, number 3. A square is enclosed in a circle. The area of the circle is 100x squared and the area of the square is 121y squared minus 22y plus 1. Write a polynomial in factored form to indicate the area inside the circle but outside the square. So first, area inside the circle but outside the square is area of the circle minus area of the square. Now, the area of the circle is 100x squared. Area of the square is this one. Now, as you notice, this one is a perfect square trinomial. So, we can change that into like this. So, we have 100x squared is 10x squared. This one is 11y minus 1 squared. So, as you can see, this is a difference of two squares in which we can factor this into 10x plus 11y minus 1, 11y minus 1. And then this is plus, this is minus, so 10x minus 11y minus 1. So simplifying this first, 10x plus 11y minus 1. Now distributing the minus here, the negative sign, we have negative times 11 is negative 11y. Negative times negative 1 is positive 1. So that's the factored form of the polynomial. Area inside the circle but outside the square. Number 4. The volume of a cubic storage bin is 125x cubed plus 27 cubic meters. Express the volume in factored form. So all you need to do is to factor this. So we have 125x cubed plus 27 is a sum of two cubes. First cube is 5x cubed. Second cube is 3 cubed. So that's 27. Following general form number 1, we have 5x plus 3. 
times 5x squared minus, because this is plus, minus 5x cubed, I mean 5x times 3, plus 3 squared. Simplifying, we have 5x plus 3 times 25x squared minus 15x plus 9. And that's the factored form of the volume. Number 5. The area of a square lot is 16x squared plus 72x plus 81cm squared. Express the length of a side of the lot in terms of x. So, a square lot has an area of side. The formula is side times side or side squared which is equal to 16x squared plus 72x plus 81. Now, in order to factor that perfect squared trinomial, we have 4x squared, that's 16x squared. 2 times 4x, because this is 4x, times 9, which is equal to 72x. Now, this 9 here will be used in our last term, 9 squared, 481. Now, simplifying, we have 4x, first term 4x, last term is 9, so that's 9, and then squared. So that's side squared. Therefore, the side of the square lot is 4x plus 9. And the measurement is 4x plus 9 centimeters.